Am I in the future? Not, not yet. <laughs> not for a while. Anyway, this I'm going to play you a guitar tune which I wrote, and uh, there's a story behind it. There's a story behind all these things this afternoon. It's, it, sometimes some of the stories I've heard this afternoon have been, you know, kind of quite illuminating of all sorts of things. It's brilliant, isn't it? Yeah. 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 Anyway, this here, this tune uh, was uh, stimulated, in fact, suggested to me by uh, a friend of mine called Angie Hallam, who lives in Rochdale. And she's not a cowboy. And, uh, Most of them aren't. Uh, no, they aren't. Yeah. Funny, funny um, aren't. They do have two old session dogs, though, they did, you know. Anyway. This, um, we attended a funeral uh, of a friend of ours called Ian Scottford. And uh, a couple of, two or three months later, she sent me some photos of, uh, it was, which, were, which were taken in the beer garden of the of the uh, Postgate pub at Acton Bridge. No. There's a lot of travel involved in this story. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and uh, it, the picture included Scotty, Ian Scotland, whose funeral we'd been to, and also two other people who, who were more joint friends of ours who had also died in the meantime. And in the picture, she, there were two people she didn't know who had also died, Jim Wright and uh, Martin Nesbitt. Oh, were in the picture as well, they were all together, we were all together, you know. Mm. And uh, so I thought, bloody hell, you know. And she entitled the photographs, she had two photos. The, the, the title of the photos was Absent Friends. So I thought, hmm. Mm. Good title. Yeah. Yes, you do. <laughs> so I wrote a little tune called Blues for Absent Friends. Mm. And uh, it doesn't have any words to it because it's a tune. <laughs> but so uh, you can sort of think uh, with the first little bit of the tune which re repeats several times this tune is a blues for absent friends it goes
Thank you. Thank you.